Guess what, this is Chris Kennel from The Raw Advantage and I got an awesome, exciting, short little interview with you. Uh, for you, not with you, with Tara. What's going on, Tara? Yeah, thanks for having me. It's awesome to be here. Absolutely. So, so awesome. Super stoked to get you oh, here. Yeah. Fellow Canadian. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, let us know where you're from, what's your name, and where we can find you first. Well, I live in British Columbia, Canada. Um, during this past winter, I lived in a place called Hunter Mile House, just south of Alaska, but now I live on Vancouver Island. Um, I run a website called 40 Below Fruity and YouTube channel. It's all about how to uh, succeed on a raw lifestyle in the cold. Because awesome. realistically, we most of us live in the cold. Yeah. Or at least where it's cold half year. Yeah, yeah. it's true, it's true. Definitely. Can't all be in the tropics. <laughs> probably wouldn't fit, but learning how to enjoy it the most where you're at is a, a huge skill. Yeah, you got to be grateful for what we've got. Because we have it so good, we really do. Eden yeah. on Earth, no matter where we are, right? Oh, exactly, yeah. It's, yeah I mean, it's a beautiful Earth and there's so many opportunities, so. Just gotta learn, just gotta have the tips to keep on the winter and you can get through it. Yeah, with, with that, since that's your specialty, uh, that's what I'd like to ask you today. What are your top tips to succeed on a raw food diet in the winter time? In the winter. Yeah. Um, you know what, my top, my top, top tip, which I find the most important thing, is to eat enough. Yeah. Because there's so many temptations in the winter. There's holidays, there's, you know, Christmas, Thanksgiving, Easter. There's wanting to be warm, yep. and people get really tempted to eat soups and stews and warm things, thinking that it'll make them warm, and it never really does. Yep. So eating enough and really stocking up on things like bananas and dates, which are in season, citrus, persimmons, just trying to take the full variety. Oh yeah, <laughs> of foods that are available in the winter because there still are a lot. Eating raisins and that kind of thing too. Um, it's really, really important to make sure you're eating enough because then you can avoid temptation. If you're, if you're full, sure. if you're hungry, you won't be able to make good choices. No, um, sure. And the second tip is definitely to be active. Yeah. A lot of people hibernate, they tend to hermit up, go in their houses, they don't want to get cold, and they, they lack circulation, they get cold extremities. It's because they're not exercising enough. Yeah. If you exercise, if you get out there in the snow, you know, I find a, a winter activity you like, snowboarding, yeah. snowshoeing, skiing, just walking in the snow, whatever it is, get active because it'll increase your circulation and make you warmer awesome. a lot more than cooked foods will. And um, third tip is going in with a good mental attitude. Yeah. Definitely, because if you decide that winter's gonna suck, yeah. it's gonna suck. Yeah. I can I can attest to that. I used to think it sucked, <laughs> and I never wanted to be around it. I always wanted to be in the tropics. Now I look at all the positivity, you know, all the chances to connect with my family and be with them and exactly. inside the house watching some show or yeah. around a fire playing a game. Yeah. And I love winter now. Exactly. You just, you just got to change your perspective, right? Yeah. Change the way you look at things and things you look at change. Awesome. So, so yeah. in review, that's make sure you get your calories, help you keep warm. Yeah. Make sure you get uh, your exercise, help improve the circulation, help you keep warm. And, come with a positive mental attitude. Uh, I think that goes with anything in life. Yeah, if you come yeah. in with a good attitude, you can succeed, always. Love it, love yeah, it. Yeah. So again, one more time, where can we find you? Is there anything you want to share with that? Yeah, 40 Below Fruity. You yeah. know, I, I love making YouTube videos, I love helping people, I love inspiring people, and that's my mission, so. Yeah, yeah, love it, yeah, love it. Yeah. Well, pleasure, and it's been great to yeah. chill with you Thank here. you, Chris. So, it's been, see you again. Uh, what a good week. You know what? If you haven't come to the Woodstock Fruit Festival, come next year, that's you have it. to. It is paradise here. It really is. Two weeks to choose or come. Oh, yeah. We'll see you there. We'll see you there. <laughs> see you guys. Bless you. <laughs> Tara Millen. 30 below fruity. Check out these two popular videos as well as get your three free ebooks by simply clicking below. Ooh. Excited to announce my new iPhone app, free with 101 freaking Ross awesome recipes, Terry retreat treats, food combining charts, shopping carts, and more.